There are downright apocalyptic images coming out of Australia right now. Everything that you can possibly think of around you is on fire. An area bigger than England has been reduced to ash. How do you convince thousands of everyday Australians to go and stand in front of something that could potentially take their life? 2019 was Australia's hottest ever year. We had over 200 consecutive days of bushfire emergencies. I'll never get those images out of my head. That was not a normal bushfire. That was something dragged up out of hell and dumped on earth. We kept trying to get the car out and it, um, it just wouldn't move. We both just looked at each other and went, this is where it ends for us. The emergency didn't stop the day the rains came. A different sort of emergency took over. This was the largest recognised volunteer firefighting organisation in the world. Most people have no idea that they're not being paid. They're just your average battler. Most people are struggling, paying the bills and keeping their family going. It amazes us how some of these people will give without even thinking of their own situation. We were asked to leave our villages. For me, straight away, it was a no. I'm sitting there and I'm going, what good am I here? What can we do to help? Volunteerism is indelibly marked into our Australian DNA. This summer, this took on a whole new meaning.